Hey, howdy, sir. Hello. Come on, boy. All right, boy. Yes? Oh, I'm sorry I didn't mean to disturb you, ma'am. Uh, is, um, is Mrs. Linton in? I'll go see. Mrs. Linton? A collar for you. Hello, Arthur. I heard you and your friends was around. I... Okay. Where's what's-his-name? Died. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah, me too. Happened a while ago. Pneumonia. Bad business. Sure. So, uh... Well, you've been... <clears throat> you've been made a widow and you come here looking for me, is that it? No, ain't like that. Arthur. Oh, okay. I... My family... I need your help. You mean the family that always looked down on me? You want me to help? It's my little brother, Jamie. 
I always liked Jamie, at least compared to the rest of them. He's broken Daddy's heart. Daddy has a heart. Don't make me beg you, Arthur. My money, my life, me. I wasn't good enough. I'm sorry. We need your help real bad. Little Jamie's joined the Chelonians, that strange religious order. Good for him. They're quite mad, Arthur. They'll kill him. You're the only person he'd listen to. So, I'm too rough to marry into your family, but it's okay to ask me to help in saving your family. I'm sorry. I understand if you don't want to help me, but... But I think of you often. Long time ago now. I'm begging you, Arthur. I say let Jamie live Jamie's life and not the nightmare that his daddy dreamed up for him. Jamie's so innocent, Arthur. Please, Arthur. Will you help me? Where is he? Somewhere out near Carmody Dell, I think. The rancher there said he'd seen him around the Cumberland Forest area. I just want him back, Arthur. If you find him, bring him to me at the station. I'll see what I can do. I'll owe you. You already owe me. Okay, boy. Let's go. <laughs> I guess you forgot about the interest. <clears throat> uh, <no. laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. 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 This one's dead. Oh. Guess that'll be a write-off.
Oh, Mr. Downs! Boy. Whatever do you want? <coughs> Mr. Thomas Downs? You owe me money. Uh, oh, no, no, I'm, I'm, I'm... We ain't a charity, Mr. Downs. Really? Threaten me, would you? Oh, please. I have a family, sir, please. I don't care about your family. Your dad's caught you, mister, and it ain't letting go. Why'd it have to come to this, huh? Ah, believe me, sir, I didn't want this either. A little patience is all I require. <laughs> Be reasonable. <laughs> You borrowed money from my business partner, Herr Strauss. You owe him, you took the money. He wants it back, what's not to understand? <laughs> Where's our money? I don't have it. Sell your place. We already owe more than it's worth. <coughs> then sell your wife, or your family, or something. We ain't your idea of charity. Is that clear? <laughs> What are you looking at? Thomas! I said what you looking at, woman! My husband isn't well! If we could just have more... Like I said, we ain't nobody's idea of charity. Get us the money! Ah, how did you get on? Not so good. He's almost dead. And they seem more or less destitute. You were a fool for lending them the money. Well, people who aren't desperate don't seem so interested in my propositions. Of course.
Yes! Lenny? Hey, Arthur. That knife's sharp enough, ain't it? Depends. Why? You feel lucky? <sighs> Do you? Oh, before me? At least six generations were born in chains. And for the last three years, I've been running from every lawman and bounty hunter west of the Lanahassee River. So yeah, I feel lucky. I'm the living embodiment of luck. That is one way of seeing things. But I'm also skilled. And in this game, you got to have luck and skill. And stupidity. The Outlaw's Trinity. Luck, skill, and just a dose of stupidity. Come on. You ain't too old and too slow just yet. After you. As you wish. You know, we should head back up that mountain sometime and make Jenny a proper grade. Something nice. You liked her, didn't you, kid? Uh, well, sure. I mean, yeah, I liked her. I know, kid. And I'm sorry about it. Anyway, longer you wait, the harder it'll be. This is pretty good. Oh, you little... Candy from a baby. Smell. It's cologne. It's liquor. It's cologne from Cologne, Germany. <laughs> oh, I, I just had a few nips, Arthur. I'm not drunk. I'm just happy. <laughs> you know, you ought to try sometime. Drinking? Happiness. Try happiness. Just, just a little. <laughs>
How you boys doing? Good, boss. How about you? Oh, I am okay, son. I'm okay. It's interesting. You know, that thing Evelyn Miller says, I ain't your king. I ain't your messiah. I hope you all know that. But my God, there are fools in this world, and there are even bigger fools that listen to them. Nobody is looking for something so much as the American people. But it is like old Miller says. Power. The kingship we seek, it is in us. And if we deny it, then we make others our lord. If we deny it, I love that. Huh. I don't quite get it. <laughs> you will, son. You will. Enjoy your evening. Okay, boy. Morning, mister. Susan? Hi there. Good morning, Arthur. How are you? Very well. 
Excellent. Good morning, Arthur. 